I sure am looking forward to seeing those lanterns by the castle. I've never seen so many flowers. Oh, breathtaking. Last one to slide to the bottom's a rotten egg. Outside world will be full of amazing things. And you, you helped me find them. Thank you. Rapunzel sure looks happy. She does. Well, her dream's gonna come true. They're sending the lanterns up after dark. Cool. We don't want to miss that. Claws up at the end of the street. Let's go see. I bet we'll find some ingredients around here. Wow, sure is a busy place. Yeah. Oh, I think. For the last princess. Huh? Huh? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Come dance with us. Keep 
thing. This is so fun! <laughs> This is so fun! <laughs> you got it! You got it! Keep dancing! This is so fun! <sighs> to the boats! Huh? been looking out a window for 18 years, dreaming about what it might feel like when those lights rise in the sky. What if it's not everything I dreamed it would be? It will be. And what if it is? What do I do then? Well, that's the good part, I guess. You get to go find a new dream.
I have something for you, too. I should have given it to you before, but I was just scared. And the thing is, I'm not scared anymore. You know what I mean? I'm starting to. I'm sorry. Everything is fine. There's just something I have to take care of. Okay. I'll be right back. It's all right, Pascal. Wow! <laughs> Could you guys have possibly picked a worse time? I don't think they appreciate the moment, Sora. What? It's time for these wet blankets to go.
Eugene? Eugene! Oh dear, <gasps> he's run off with the crown and forgotten you. No, he wouldn't. Who are you? <gasps> Forget Flynn Rider. You know where you belong, and it's not with him. Now. So I followed you, and I saw them attack you, and... Oh my... Let's go! Let's go! Before they come to! Isn't that Rapunzel? Wait! Rapunzel! Oh. Show some decorum. You again! Marluxia! The girl has found her dear mother. You should let them be. And why is that? Because Rapunzel is far too important. Atop her tower, she must remain out of sight and live out her days with Mother Gothel. And never see anyone else? But that's like locking her in some prison. That is exactly what it's like. Rapunzel's hair holds the powerful magic of healing. And yes, Mother Gothel wants it for herself, as do others. And if Mother Gothel's actions will protect Rapunzel, preserve her, then she is doing the organization a favor. What favor? Let's say she's keeping Rapunzel on the shelf for us. An extra pawn in case you fail to find the remaining Guardians of Light. And we have occasion to call on other Hearts of Light instead. A new seven hearts to fill out the ranks. New seven hearts? Yes. Seven who inherited the princess's light after their role was fulfilled. So you don't care about her? You guys just want Rapunzel for your own purposes. Well, you're done here. Hmm. I just knew you would go and make a scene. Very well. Then it's lights out for you. Oh. 
You always were such a sound sleeper. Please speak up, Rapunzel. You know how I hate the mumbling. I am the lost princess, aren't I? Did I mumble, Mother? Or should I even call you that? Oh, Rapunzel. Do you even hear yourself? Why would you ask such a ridiculous question? <laughs> uh, it was you! It was all you! Everything I did was to protect you. Uh, Rapunzel! I've spent my entire life hiding from people who would use me for my power. Rapunzel! When I should have been hiding from you! Where will you go? He won't be there for you. What did you do to him? That criminal's to be hanged for his crimes. No. No, no, it's all right. Listen to me. All of this is as it should be. No! No! You were wrong about the world. And you were wrong about me. And I will never let you use my hair again! You want me to be the bad guy? Fine. Now I'm the bad guy. Sora okay? We don't know. We keep calling his name and shaking him, but he won't open his eyes. Sora? Wake up! Hmm. Unresponsive sidekick. Wait a minute. I know how to fix this. Max, give him a wash. <laughs> That did the trick. Nice work, Max. Huh? How did I end up? Oh no! Flynn! Rapunzel's being held prisoner! That's right. In her mother's tower. This calls for a rescue. Are you with me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Max. 
From here, Flynn. Go help Rapunzel. Thanks. Enough already. Get out of our way. It's over! 
See you again. Huh? 
The tower! I know! I'm going! Save him. I will go with you. Uh, no, no, Rapunzel. Uh, uh, I'll uh, never run. I'll never try to escape. Just let me heal him, and you and I will be together forever, just like you want. Everything will be the way it was. I promise. Just like you want. Just. Let me heal him. In case you get any ideas about following us. You... Eugene! I'm so sorry. Everything is gonna be okay, though. No, Rapunzel. I promise. You have to trust me. No! I can't let you do this. And I can't let you die. But if you do this... But if you do this, then you will die. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Rapunzel... Wait... Fall into darkness. We can't allow her near our pure light now. Her presence would only cast a pall over it. Yeah! 
Rapunzel? <gasps> Eugene. Did I ever tell you I've got a thing for brunettes? Oh. <gasps> Eugene! <laughs> wow, Rapunzel, you're finally going to get to see your real home. I know. I mean, I can't believe it! I can finally be with my real family! I couldn't have done it without your help. You're welcome! <laughs> well, from where I'm standing, the kingdom couldn't ask for a better princess. And I couldn't have asked for better sidekicks! Thanks. Yes, thank you so much. Happy the Emeraptor! Mm-hmm. Now, Flynn, you and Maximus play nice. Huh? <laughs> You're gonna be great. Huh? We haven't seen the guy controlling the monsters in a while, so that's one less worry. But there's still a chance that he might be around here somewhere. Well, if he comes back and tries to bother Rapunzel again, then Flynn will keep her safe. And we three won't be far behind. True, but nevertheless, I won't let her out of my sight. Oh, Eugene. Eugene? Oh, <laughs> that's my real name. Eugene Fitzherbert. That's right. I never told you guys. That's different. Oh, I think it's a great name. Me too. Nice to re-meet you, Eugene. Hey, I thought I was the only one you were going to tell? Don't worry. I've saved plenty of Fitzherberty secrets just for you. Really? Hey, what are you two lovebirds talking about? Nothing! <laughs> Nothing! Oh, you did tell us! Yeah, it's not nice to keep secrets. This one is none of your business. <laughs> Maximus, get him! Huh? <laughs> You have got to be kidding me! Another world where we got doodly squat. Hmm. You sure this box thingy's even real? Yes. Yeah, just how do you know that? It is etched. It's what? Come with me. Where to? Those bozos ain't gonna help us. Sora sure not looking for the box. Who said anything about following them? No. What? We're too late? Yes. Evan would know all about the replicas from his time as Vexen in the organization. He was re-completed like the rest of us, but he didn't regain consciousness. After Lee left, he must have woken and taken his leave. Alias here and Dylan went out and turned the whole town upside down to try and find him. But no Evan. That's not good. What about his research? Unfortunately, his work on the replicas was incomplete. 
There may still be documents around, but all of them from well before he made any significant progress. Do you have any idea where he might go? There's no place that he could go now that he's human. He has no means of leaving this world. The dark corridors! Are beyond his faculties and mine now. Oh, but not everyone's. What if Evan was taken? Of course! The organization could also use the replicas. To fill out their ranks. We'd better go tell Master Yen Sid. And Sora. And the others, too. Hmm. <laughs> Humanity is a precious gift, and yet you desire to return to the organization? Oh yes, of course. One eradication at Axel's hands was enough to learn where not to place my trust. He gave you a second lease on life. He ripped me away from the one thing I care about. I don't require humanity. Give me my research. I must see it to fruition, no matter the cost. The replicas. Yes. <laughs> Soon they will replace, not just replicate. Given a heart, they can become just as real as any human. What excellent tidings. I would hate to think we invited you back into our ranks, only for you to fail to deliver our final vessel. Vexen. <laughs> hey, a new zone! You guys should check it out!
Is something there? Ranger! 